What's going on, everybody? My name is Manly92, and I am bringing you the first episode of my Straight Up series. Basically, I'm going to be talking about what's going through my head and what I'm doing in this gameplay. So, uh, this probably isn't the most spectacular gameplay you've seen, but it does have a special feature that I thought was a good first episode for this series. So, uh, to get started, I'm playing on Cracked, some Team Deathmatch. Uh, if the video would go on a little faster here, I can tell you what class I'm using. Uh, I believe it's a commando with, yeah, it is the pro pipe too, but there isn't many uh, kills from that. Uh, I'm also running the jammer, which you will see utilized somewhat in this gameplay. But uh, start off by throwing a Semtex over there. It's always a good bet just to chuck one over there if you usually get a kill, but I didn't this time. So uh, take cover to the right over here. Try to get through and into their spawn as quick as possible. Uh, there's a lucky hip fire spray right there. I'm not going to take credit for that, but... Uh, Basically, you want to push forward as far as you can, which you can see probably most of my team is doing. And you just, that's the goal for Cracked, is just keep moving back and forth and switching the spawns for TDM. So, uh, and you can see I come up over here in the building and I throw the jammer up. Basically, it's always a safe bet just to put the jammer in one of the main buildings of this thing. Uh, I do see some movement upon retrospect of watching this, but I don't think I saw that guy to begin with. But he dies anyway, so, uh... I see, quickly see a guy running through there, and that's where the new tube comes in handy. Uh, you want to take him down quick and not worry about what's going on. But right here, I get into a little bit of a situation. Two people are shooting at me. Uh, I should have noob tubed the bottom one, but I didn't. Uh, so, try to take him out. Uh, I have no idea where he went, so I'm just trying to get out of there. I uh, realize my commando's running low. I gotta avoid him too, so I'm in a bit of a situation. <laughs> Pick up an infield with the grenade launcher, so uh, that's pretty good luck that I keep picking up noob tube guns. But <laughs> so I try to get out of there because I didn't really like that position. So uh, I switch around, come around the side, keep my back to the edge of the level. Uh, I see a lot of things going on. I like the FAMAS a lot better than infield, so I pick it up and I pick up one, but I can't get the two. Uh, one of my perks is Hardline, and I can see them up here, Sleight of Hand Pro and also Marathon, just so I can run around the map as quick as possible, but Hardline, I think I have Pro, uh, just so I can re-roll the care package, and I am using the care package, and uh, you'll see once this drops in and I re-roll it, why I felt this was a good gameplay, but I pick up the Death Machine on the re-roll, so uh, I'm going to give some pointers on how I use the Death Machine, and maybe you can better use that if you get it, so... Uh, I'm kind of out in the open here, so I'm just trying to get as many people down as possible, and I'm lucky I didn't die from that noob tube, because uh, I don't have flak jacket, so it could have easily taken me down. But uh, right now I see a lot of people across the map, and this thing fires as straight as an arrow, so you just if you see movement or you see somebody on the map, you also have the blackbird up, so it's helping me a lot with this death machine, but uh, basically you just want to keep spraying. Also, I don't think you're going to use all those 400 bullets, and I don't, so uh, spray the shit out of everything, so... Uh, this guy camping up here waiting from the dogs and I just spray right around the corner and he's done so and uh, usually there's somebody in that window so I try to shoot some feeler shots to see if he's there but uh, I see a lot of dots coming up over here so I figure hey this is a good place to just post up behind this car and uh, drop them as they all walk by but uh, upon the second swipe I see somebody come behind me so I figure I gotta get out of here in case I get flanked and uh, that napalm is drops down I see that guy in the window, and I'm not paying attention to my radar, probably one of my biggest flaws of this gameplay, but could have had that death machine for a lot longer, but, so yeah, basically you just want to keep your back to something, uh, use the radar and use a blackbird if you can, uh, I'm just trying to go for some random noob tube shots now, <laughs> but, uh, uh, just looking for some guys, I see somebody jump out that window over there, and, uh, this is a pretty nice shot. You really had to work the angle for that or else you could have easily missed or got a hit marker with that so uh, this dude comes out of nowhere and flanks me so I have no excuse for that death but uh shoot him couldn't catch up with him but uh and right here there's something a little weird uh, he managed to elude the gunfire I'm just spraying and oh two piece <laughs> hit fire two piece but so I'll take anything I can get uh, he's sitting up in the window again they really like the building this game so uh, throw another one don't get any hit markers or anything so I think I decide against the going up in that building flank around pick him up for my counter spy uh, I can't remember. I think I have the chopper on this one too, but uh, I don't think I get it this gameplay just uh, because I was kind of running around hectically. So 
I wasn't really trying to get my kill streak, so I was just kind of having fun. So there's my other care package, Gan. Uh, do uh, tuck it down, and I think somebody else runs up and uh, tries to take me out. So right from the right there, throw some shots out. Don't even get a hit marker. That's some terrible aim. Oh, I do, but uh, <laughs> and I get the stick. So and with the direct impact kill. So I re-roll this again. For an RCXD, uh, I noticed it's 7,400 kills, so I just throw this in as quick as possible, and I don't really have much experience driving the RC, but <laughs> so I hit everything in sight, and that's the game. But uh, So I figured that was just some good tips for the death machine. It doesn't come up very often, so a lot of people might not be the best with it, but I go 16-3, and three, so I hope you enjoyed my straight-up series, and uh, I will be doing this probably once every week, so uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.